Well, this is home for me. It's in my blood. Love the farms. Love the atmosphere. Love the smell of the air. It's awesome. A lot of people come out here for the beaches, for the activities, pictures. It's a really beautiful place. Um, wineries are all over the North Fork and South Fork. Some of my favorites. Pindar. Love it. But one of my real true jams is coming out here. I really enjoy the beaches. I like getting in the water, um, taking pictures of water, taking pictures of the beaches, the surroundings. Love spearing fish. One of my hobbies. And uh, getting them inside of a flour tortilla and, and eating it. But um, yeah. So I'm here to talk about sharks. My first encounter. Love the sound of the gravel on the beach. Uh, this is one of my hot spots I enjoy. And uh, this morning was different for me. I came, came in expecting to, uh, you know, grab some fish and fill up my mom's freezer. So I'm trekking out to my spot and had no idea that um, this would kind of change my outlook of the underwater world. So <clears throat> along with fishing, you never know what to expect in the water. And this uh, day is definitely... Um, one that marked me for, for quite a while here. Um, so once I get out, I kind of get set up, get my gear, get my gun ready, I get my GoPro going here. So I usually, uh, usually film things and uh, show my mom some, uh, some really cool underwater shots. And this day, well, the visibility wasn't the best. But, uh, you know, it's just one of those things. So you just take advantage of it or you, um, or you go home. So <laughs> suck it up. So I'm, I'm making my way out here and uh, getting my gear all set here. My reel kind of pops off, slip back on, no big deal. So I'm making off a short swim here and, you know, just heading out about 100, 150 yards. And that's kind of where I end up. And just looking for some structure, some rocks. Um, I saw a lot of stripers out there. Uh, and I was just expecting to uh, land a big striper or go for some, bl uh, some blacks or, uh, you know, some flukes, checking around some rocks. And uh, so this is pretty much where the game changer happened for me. And it's not like the water's crystal clear and you, you're going to get an image here, but this is basically kind of what happens to me. And I'm diving down. There's a rock off to my left. It's about 20, 23 feet of water. Um, I'm way offshore. And right about here, you can see the tail right in front of my spear. And I looked at it, and I'm like, wait a minute, that is not a sand shark. Uh, the color's different. That's not a fluke. I'm going down the fish list here, and it is like, I'm like, what is that? And by the shape of the fin, you can see it is a little notch in the back that really freaked me out. And I came up, and I, I just kind of said, okay, well, let's, uh, let's go down again. Maybe there's just something I just saw something. So here I am, good visual. I'm offshore. And I, uh, I pop back down, and uh, everything's the same. And immediately, the second dive, boom, I come up behind this guy right there. And there's a slow-mo, and I give him a little stick, and I'll jab him. And I'm <laughs> on my way up, I'm like, what the heck was that? Oh, I was a shark. So I make the long haul in, and I'm paddling, I'm paddling, kind of like looking behind me. And it freaked me out. And in my head, I'm thinking, great, there's sharks in the water. <laughs> so... Um, I don't know about you, but that, uh, that was a real game changer for me because I had no fear of the water. There's never any sharks in Long Island Sound. What? Well, guess what? Did some research. Ten sharks you can encounter in Long Island Sound. This is the guy that I came up against. It's a sand tiger shark. They're all over the place. I didn't know that. They breed in the Great South Bay. I didn't see this part of them. That would have really freaked me out. Um, probably would have had a heart attack. Smooth dogfish. Very common sharks that we're going to see in Long Island. All of these guys are uh, threshers. Uh, there's a dusky. You know, these are common sport fishermen. Um, sandbar shark. And these are all common that I did not know of. But this next one here is one that you never want to see. And that's the bull shark. They bite before they ask questions. Uh, you see these things, you're probably going to lose a limb right away. <laughs> so, um, you know, you got the blue shark. Uh, these are pretty well ocean dwellers. You're not going to see hammerheads too much around here, but they are definitely there. Um, but 
you know, long story short, it was, um, you know, an opportunity for me that uh, kind of rocked my world. And this one here, you see this one, you're done. Um, I always seem like they're going to be in deeper waters, but they are definitely, definitely around. This is what I like about Long Island. Enjoy it. All the pictures, the beauty. Love the North Fork. I love getting in the water and taking the fruits of the land. But, um, but yeah, that was really one of the things that uh, rocked my world. And uh, I love it. But, you know, man. So warning, guys. There's sharks out there.